In a recent five-year span, the number of skin cancer cases in Hawaii increased. That's according to a study looking into the disease rates nationwide. KITV4's Ali Iduko explains why the risk of developing skin cancer is higher for some than others. It's advice we've heard time and time again. Wearing sunscreen protects against skin cancer. It's something to take seriously. A new report from Quilt Wizard, based on data from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, reveals the number of skin cancer cases in Hawaii jumped 14% between 2015 and 2019. Awareness is key, and so being aware that this is a real risk that's out there is important to know about. Experts say men are twice as likely to develop skin cancer than women here in Hawaii because they're less likely to wear sunscreen and more likely to work outside. Obviously that's changing. That's constantly evolving. Aware of the sun's harmful impacts, Tony Tacklin is one Hawaii man who deviates from that trend. I make sure that I stay protected. With a thick layer of sunscreen on his face, Tacklin surfs in the Ala Moana area five days a week. I never used to wear a shirt, but now I do wear a shirt, a UV protected shirt, because you don't, just don't know where you, you may get skin cancer. Ironically, Wizard Quote analyst Rob Bott points out skin cancer rates were lower in sunnier states such as New Mexico and Texas compared to others with less sunlight. And that's generally attributed to people doing a better job taking care of themselves and taking the precautions to protect themselves. While the number of cases may have climbed, Bot says the death rate is down 6% nationally. Dr. Susanna Grima, a dermatologist with Hawaii Pacific Health, explains the rise in cases is seen more among older groups and less people are dying because they're seeking help. I think we are going in the right path of, of identifying these skin cancers early, and we do have great therapies out there now that are aimed towards treating them effectively. On top of wearing sunblock and protective clothing, <laughs> Dr. Grima also advises the public to seek regular skin checks. Ali Iduklo, KITV4 Island News.